Hello and welcome to this demo about the Enterprise Search customization in SAP Business One version for SAP HANA. So we offer in the Enterprise Search in the drop down section and by clicking here on the gear icon the search customization. This search customization will help you to adjust the current search scope of your Enterprise Search. So before customizing it I would recommend you to export first your current search customization. So just click on export. Then a wizard will appear and we will say continue. And we will save the file, in this case on the desktop. Call it initial state enterprise search. Okay. So let's go ahead and customize the search. So first of all, let's think of the following scenario. Two banks are merging and the bank code has changed for a bank which is used by some of our customers. For example, we can use HSBC. So if I search for it, I will not find any results in my company. So what can I do? I go to the search customization and I will go to the master data and to my business partner. And I will just search here for bank. And I will find here in the OCRD table, the bank code. So if I'm not sure which fields I need, I can always go to the business partner master data window, select one business partner. And if I activate in view the system information, and I will go, for example, here to the payment terms, I can see here's the bank code and here's the bank name. And if I look at the bank name in the lower left corner, so around here, I can see OCRD comma bank code. So by just activating this feature, I can easily track every field I, I want to, to look after. Also, like the price list is uh, list num. You can see it in the lower left screen in the brackets. So these are things I will consider. So I will use the bank code. I just drag and drop it here. Let me minimize that, close it even. And now the bank code is inside the search scope. You can see it here, fields and search scope. And I can also allow it to be filtered or disabled. So let's do one or two more examples. For example, we saw the price list, which was list num. So just put it in here. And we will also add another one, which is the state. So there's state one and state two. I will take just state one. And as you can see, we differentiate here between main tables and line tables. So in the line tables, we have different uh, tables available, different database fields. So if we mouse over a record, we can see the information of the line tables. So for example, if we hover our mouse over a business partner search result in the enterprise search, we can see all this information in the pop-up window. If you want to Add, for example, here also the state. We can do it by just adding the state. There's uh, two options here. I will use the one of the CRD1 table as all the other results here. And I can see also the zip code. Maybe it's not the bad idea to filter by zip code. So let's just add it here to the search scope again to be able to filter it. So we have now defined four new fields for the search scope and one more field here uh, in the line table. So just apply it. Okay, this is done. So we can say OK, or we can just even export it from here. 
as new export like new enterprise search scope and save it. Okay, so if I now click again here on the magnifying glass and search for HSBC, I can now find four records. Four of my business partners are using the bank HSBC for their account. And what else can I do? I can now filter by state. Okay, so this was also not possible before. So, for example, I will just take this one. And what can I also do? I can also now filter by the price list, so just this price list. And then I had also opportunity to just use zip codes, starting for example with a one. So now I got my final result. And if I go with my mouse over here and hover to this, I can also see now the state. It's hard to show it with you with the mouse, but you can see on the right now also that there is a state listed in here okay so with a few clicks i really customized my enterprise search and if i want to go back i can just click here to import an existing search customization so i will take the initial one here say open and say continue the deployment is finished and I say done. And if I again now search for HSPC, I will not find any results anymore. And um, if I would search for a business partner like um, C3, so business partners, you can see that in the business partners, I have no choice for zip code or the uh, price list anymore. And if I, or if I go with the mouse over the business partner, you can also see that the state is not anymore in the pop-up window. All right, so that's all I want to show to you. So thank you for watching the session and bye-bye.